Hey guys, I wanted to give you another example of how we can use the reciprocal dynamic technique to unlock some ranges of motion. So Mike here has a little bit of a, a restriction when he's going into left um, lateral flexion. I was thinking it was the Virginia Tech Hokie shirt because that could cause problems. Actually, if it was a Nebraska Cornhuskers shirt, he would be really strong, but we've already ruled that out as a problem, surprisingly. So we're going to have to go with some energy medicine here. So I'm just going to have Mike go ahead and lean to the right. And you'll notice that there's a pretty good angle of things loosened up here, and that's great. So let's have you go ahead and lean to the left. And you can see that there's a lot more restriction here on the left-hand side. So as I'm testing his body now for which reciprocal it is that we need to work with, it's coming up that the sphenoid and coccyx are actually needing to be reset, more specifically just the sphenoid fascia. So I'm going to have to take Mike, take his hand and put it right on his coccyx down here. And then I'm going to come in here and we're just going to do our regular reciprocals technique where we're just going to have him breathe a connection between the two to get that going. So I'm just going to have Mike have you breathe a little bit of a connection deep in your head here all the way down to your coccyx. So just take some nice deep breaths for me. So as he's doing that, I'm just going to kind of get that fascia in there. I'm just putting a little bit of a torque to release the fascia around the sphenoid, which his body is saying is the priority reciprocal that needs to be reset to restore left lateral flexion. Now for anybody else, this could have been anything from the xiphoid, right, to the knee, it could be anything. But for what Mike's body wants to do, it's the sphenoid. So a couple more deep breaths in. Really clearing that torque out. Okay, that's great. So let's just have you go ahead and lean to the left again, left lateral flexion. Yeah, and now go ahead and lean to the right. Awesome, so you can see how that um, left lateral flexion is completely opened up and loosened up now just for releasing fascia around the sphenoid. So thank you so much for watching that demo and we hope to see you in a reciprocal dynamics class soon. Thank you.